Very good afternoon and welcome to the Silit International Cricket Stadium. We're all set for the third and final T20 International between uh, Sri Lanka and Bangladesh. Shanto will spin the coin as usual. It's a tail. It's a tail. So Shanto is winning the toss. His, the habit continues. What are you going to be doing and the reasons for that? Uh, I like to bowl first. Good afternoon, everyone. Good afternoon, Shamanoi. Sri Lanka, three changes they have made. One in the Hasaranga, the captain who was suspended for the first two games. There's also Dananjir De Silva to open the batting for Avish Kafan. Should boost his confidence. As a captain, lead from the front without on field umpires uh, making their way in. Previous screen, Nazmul Sanchanto has led the team well. A very positive mindset. Uh, the two Sri Lankan openers uh, make their way into the middle as I welcome Russell Arnold. Uh, Tawhid Ridoy the other day. Change in opening pair. Dhananja De Silva is back into the side and straight away. Just in form, so he's been replaced. Gosal Mendes is uh, in there opening the batting. Close to 1,500 runs and 64 innings. Who's also been in good rhythm. 41 wickets in 37 matches. Shori full Islam. Starts off with the full one. Open the face of the bat and uh, they're off and running. As he usually does, giving that ball opportunity to swing. Batting first or second. Oh, ask for it, ask for it. Now, was there a bat? I think there was a slight inside edge. If not... Move it again, appeal again. Umpire not interested yet again. Shoriful as an adamant and he's convinced the captain. I've checked the feet, fair delivery. We can start with front on first, please. There comes the ball checker. Well, pitching in line, impact in line, wickets missing. I'm going back to Shaikat on field. Shaikat, you are going to stay with your not out decision. Please stand by. You can signal now you're on screen. <laughs> oh, that's gone through. That's gone through the hands of Rishad. Just the breather Sri Lanka needed. Ends the over. Eight for no loss. Now, for the first time, there was a bit of foot movement. He's pushed on to that front foot. Now, why he was able to do that was because. The line wasn't good there, it was width on offer, so he's able to make a better decision and move. Hero dear. Oh. Cracking stroke from Dananjay De Silva, square of the wicket on the offside. Four runs. Graceful Dananjay De Silva, it always looks like he's got so much time. But paying the price. For erring in line, there's width. Sri Lanka have hit two boundaries and both went with on offer. Straight away, evidence of what you were saying, Russell Arnold. Goes Ariel, and here's the wicket they were looking for. Daskin Ahmed breaks through and gets the first wicket. He's kept him going, so that was good from Shanto. He's usually given Tuskin the one over and opted to swap him around. Now, throughout these innings, Tananjay De Silva has been looking to break free. Even the last ball of the previous over, the ball hitting high on the bat because of that extra bounce the bowlers are getting on this pitch. We see that once again, and that's why he's not able to get the pace. To get it over Shumasaka. The first wicket's fallen. De Silva has gone for eight. Well bowled, but just dip in front of the keeper. And that allows a boundary. Four buys, four buys, but you should do better. Ditton Kumadas, body behind. Yes, it did bounce awkwardly just in front of you. Can't let those through. Now, Sri Lanka, the, whatever the runs they've got, have come on the back of a bit of clumsiness from Bangladesh in the field. But they see movement, the angle in from. Tuskin, it pitches and straightens. Beats everyone. Oh, in control. Very much in control. Finds the gap. It's a very good stroke to get his uh, first boundary. Come in the Mendes. And on top of the bounce, lanes into it, doesn't try to hit too hard. So, so good to watch. Back of a lane. 
But the key to Mendes and the other top order batters of Sri Lanka has been his work has been crisp. Nice one. Lying totally on timing. Goes full, but he times it even better. Finds the gap yet again, same region. Back to back boundaries for Kamindo Mendes. It makes it 12 runs of the over. After four, Sri Lanka are 30 for one. Oh, he's got that over. The spinner introduced and Mendes again breaking free. We've seen this happen right throughout the T20 International Series. The moment the ball bounces a bit more, you don't get your timing. You're unable to beat the field and that freedom doesn't come by you. That's why playing on these pitches will make you learn, will make you understand how to ride that bounce and bring in different... Can he make amends? Doesn't make amends. First ball down the leg side. Easy pickings. Really uh, concedes a boundary in the first ball. He bowls. Good afternoon, Parvez Mahroof. Good afternoon to you, Arthur. Good afternoon to all our viewers. Down the leg side, the first ball by Fizz. Usal Mendes is very, very strong from his hip level. That occasion, something close to his knee level. And with Dhananjali Silva's case, uh, Arthur. Batting at number three straight away, getting opportunity to open the batting. I think we might go upstairs. Yep, we do. They'll come back. At the striker's end, can I have your best side on angle, please? Keep it rolling through. Better has grounded his bat before the wicket was broken. I have a decision for the big screen. Well, in, isn't he? Yeah. Very pleased to see. Again, this time he goes uh, and goes all the way. That's the danger. I mean, that is a beautiful shot. Yeah, Kusal Mendes said he had enough. He was kept quiet in the last over. Richard doing the right thing, giving a little bit of air. Kusal Mendes straight down the ground. A nice stroke, nice follow through, middle of the bat. That went a long way. This is good batting by Kusal. Put in the pressure. Again, down the ground. Long off fielder. Takes it. Sarful Islam safe as houses and Kamindu Mendes just what trying to do what Kusal Mendes was trying to do come down the ground hit it over the top holds on at uh, long off now that is an excellent piece of bowling you've got to hand it to uh, Rishad Hussain remember we spoke about not being afraid to toss it up to the batter throwing on the bed he saw Kusal Mendes hitting him for a six but this time again a little bit wide maybe the wrong one it didn't come in and in the end a very comfortable catch it's an important wicket to see the back of Kamindo Mendes gone for 12 but for the short run oh nearly nearly to that fielder maybe that was the plan good work in the deep I'll tell you what's the plan Arthur is to bring Taskin Amaras short ball and he gets hold of it it's gone Gone the distance. Attempted slow delivery gone all wrong for Taskin Ahmed. Was short, just stood up for Kusal Mendes. He likes it over there. Likes it near his hip. Did not intend to keep at all along the ground. Wanted to keep it up in the air. And that went a long way. This is the penalty you pay when you are want a bowler. It goes down the ground. That is a cracking shot. He picks up the length very quickly, mid on inside the circle. It just goes uh, between the bowler and the fielder. Gets past, goes for the boundary. Right in the one in the sock. Clears his front foot and smashes it down the ground. Slow ball attempted by Fizz. Pretty sure the next one will won't be in the ace half. It's possibly be a slow ball into the pitch. Or a quick bouncer. That's a poor delivery. That is a poor delivery and it's gone the distance down the leg side. Easy, too easy for uh, Kushal Mendes to hit it for the maximum. Yeah, that's a pie by Mustafiz. Nothing delivery. Slower delivery attempted again. Just set up. 
uh, Kusal Mendes. Bangladesh, the maximums they've been hit so far have been feeding Kusal Mendes in his favourite area. In the dugout today, Samad Jaisal. For Bangladesh. You see, Mustafi is gone for so many. There you go. It's wide and it's four more. That's a poor delivery again by Mustafa. He's digging in short and wicketkeeper Luton Das had no chance. This is something that Sri Lanka needed to change gears, to change the momentum. And this over so certainly 70 runs so far and still a ball remaining. Yeah, he's been all over the place. Mustafa Rahman. Seventeen already. Oh, he's got all of that. That's for sure. That's going many a mile. Oh, what a stupendous strike that for half a dozen. He was eyeing that. He was watch where his front foot goes. Throws it to the leg side. So he creates that shape. Able to hit through. Under pressure now, Bangladesh. Lanka have started motoring along. And they have got to innovate. Does that well too. Delectable looking shot that. So full of confidence. He came in for one over in the previous game. And he's playing a different option. He's quite aware what Sumasakar can do. He's trying to ease the pressure of having to use the spinners with Hasaranga there. And his weights right to come on to him this time, just a little swivel round, controlled shot, and he gets his 50. Very, very well compiled 50 of 35 bolts. Crushed away, just beyond. Did he get a better hand to that one? Could have been the wicket they're looking for. Mahmoud al making a desperate effort at that one. Sri Lanka reach 100. Yeah, that's a drop chance. Mahmoud al should have hauled that in. And he's had to reach for it, but he hit it quite hard. Straight through his hands. Mamdul Ariad will not be happy with his own effort. Could have had him again. Shumar Saka, golden arm. And this is a big wicket now. Very full. Oh, he's picked that up. It's way up in the air. It's traveling many a mile. Such an easy looking shot that for the maximum. Kusal Mendes just leaning into it. Told you he's finding his timing. Now that will hurt Mahmudul Ariad who dropped him in the previous over. Mustafa Zor in for his third over. Starts off with a slower one. And a lovely shot to bring up the 50 partnership between the two. They're well placed now. One. Oh no, that might go to hand. It does. That is the breakthrough they've been looking for. Mustafa Zoraman tempts. Pasaranga to try a ramp shot is very, very well just catched at the boundary. Yeah, needed a tall man. Bangladesh were lucky they had Shoriful Islam there, probably the tallest in the team. He judged it well. And plucked it because if he didn't, that was going for six. Now, Chanto, I mentioned he's been pushed to bring his bowlers in, his faster bowlers. And he brought in Mustafi Zur at this stage because he wanted a wicket. And he gets it. Asaranga, well, not the impact that he usually does give. 15 of 13. Oh, not the way to start off a uh, new over. And that's been uh, just put away with the utmost of ease. You offer a freebie like that, juicy for toss. It's only one place it was going to head to the boundary. What you want, not what you want, but yes, it, as a batsman, yes. Another full toss, and that goes the distance. So, Chanto straight away to his bowler. Really, really, is that what you want to be bowling? Is that why I brought you on? Incredible, how can you? But I you can be given a full toss, but two and two, and juicy ones. This is not on. Very, very ordinary bowling by Madhya Hassan. He has to reach, he slices it, but it went there. With not the most absolute of controls, he's got enough on the bat. Get it racing away to another boundary. It's not big boundaries here. 
Insulet, 60 meters square of the meter. wicket. There's pace on offer, there's weight, and you're bowling to a batsman who's striking it really, really well. Just 64 meters on. Up on the air, fielder coming around, trying to get to it, and does. That is another one. This is a very, very good take. It was swirling in the air. Shoriful is elated. Mustafa Zurawan has taken a, an excellent catch, much to the delight of the crowd here. That sure was a brilliant catch. Again, the extra bounce from Shoriful. They really are struggling to come to terms with that or to dominate against him. Now, Mustafa Zur. He misjudged it initially, he overran it, but then managed to readjust and get in position and get his hands to it. Asalanka, he's out for three. Throws it back. Proactive as a bowler also, Tuskin Ahmed. Yes, the skipper has been proactive, but Mabai, you as a bowler, you know, there are some captains who like to chat all the time. Uh, just like Shanto is, there are some captains who let you do your go about your business. Which one did you prefer? In the air, it was rising up on him. They brought that fielder in. Shomo Sharkar makes no mistake. They get the breakthrough. Taskin Ahmed with the wicket. They've got the big fish. They've got Kushal Mendes. Looking at how Shanto and Taskin Ahmed celebrating, there's a plan in place and it worked perfectly. Possibly not expecting a bouncer with pace. Kusal Mendes trying to go over mid wicket for paid for pace. Yet possibly wanting to play to a square leg. That would be a better option. On that occasion, high on the bat, an easy catch at mid wicket. Exactly what Bangladesh wanted. The set bat, set batter of Kusal Mendes departing. That will be a major lose for Sri Lanka. Nevertheless, a magnificent knock of 86 by Kusal. Hit straight, hit downtown. This is uh, very well played by Shanaka as he gets off the mark with the boundary. It's a powerful shot by Dasun Shanaka. That will give him a lot of confidence. Sri Lanka needs him to come good today to get that 180 mark. Not a bad delivery at all by Rishad. That's the power that Dasun Shanaka possess. Brilliant. That's why he's been sent uh, ahead of some. Oh, big hike. That has got wings on it. Should go all the way and it does for a maximum from Matthews. To the hills it goes. Quicker by Richard and Angelo Matthews. This is what he does best. In through the line, absolutely no turns, killing on to the bat. And powerful stroke. Brilliant Angelo Matthews. Clean hit. This is well pitched. A fielder in contention. Good catch taken. Shomo Sharkar takes his third catch in this innings. And Rishad yet again gets a breakthrough. Very good bowling. Absolutely. Threw the ball way outside the Austin. Angelo Matthews would have tried to go straighter or mid wicket if it's uh, to the pitch of the uh, stumps. This delivery was way outside the Austin. Angelo Matthews saw the ball so full. The temptation was there. Did the right thing as far as I'm concerned. Trying to go for maximum. But in the end, take a look at that for a line. Nowhere near Angelo. Almost like a forehand. And saw Misakar. Oh, was a good catch. Running to his uh, left. Takes it cleanly. Matthews gone for 10. Short. Top edge. Fortune favors the brave. Shanaka gets boundary to end this over. Seven runs uh, of the last one bowled by Shori Full. Starts off with the cutter, moves the front leg and clears. Clean hit from Samara Vikrama. A boundary to start the last over. A slow delivery goal all wrong for Fizz. Expecting the ball to grip, but this pitch has so much grass, it's going to skid on to the bat. Sadhir Samara Vikrama was well set, set himself up and smashed it over mid wicket for a boundary. Comes down the wicket, he connects it and connects it well, wings deployed for a six. 
And that's more like it by Dasun Shanaka. This time coming down the ground. Near to the pitch of the delivery. That's a good shot. That's the power that we all know about Dasun Shanaka. Smashed it. The face not comfortable bowling the Yorkers. The previous one of a slow ball got away with it, and this occasion, what a strike! All of a sudden, 171 now. Take it to that psychological mark of 180, which I think in the air should fall safe. It does. They're coming back for the second throw in just a bit wide. Good flick on from uh, Riton Das. No look. Umpire SIS Shoiko straight away referred it upstairs to the TV umpire Gadi Sohel. Well, umpire to director, Little we does have an you beauty. Foul for run out at the striker end. Can I have your best side on angle, please? Keep it rolling through. Keep it rolling through. Yeah, better is well short of his ground. I have a decision for the big screen. Does Bangla Bank decision pending? is uh, rocket out it was a no look flick on to get rid of dasun shanaka in the last delivery of the innings but in the end i thought uh, it fell short about five to ten runs a couple of sixes to end at 19 with sri lanka and in their 20 overs at 174 for seven yeah a bit of a partnership to steady the ship firstly by coming and koshal mendes 34 of 27 it led to this total of 174. Very impressive bowling card for Bangladesh. Shorty for Islam bowled well, bowled decently, went for runs but picked up a couple of wickets and Saumi Sarkar bowling one over. Alright, so it is the decider and for Bangladesh to win the series they need to chase 175 of their 20 over. Welcome back, we're at the Sillet International Cricket Stadium for the third T20 International of the Dutch Bangla Bank. Getting a nail-biting finish, competitive series. Little bit of grip in the pitch, so Tikshana, Hasaranga. Absolutely, I think also the realization. He's done a little bit of damage to his hamstring, happened the other day. Litton Das left out so that Nuan Tushara can have a run. That's uh, the two, def two fielders outside the circle. Oh, square him out. Big appeal from behind. Short for the late Mishoy Shoykot is not interested. Are they going to go for a review? There were two noises. He has the habit of going across the line of his stumps. Fair delivery. We can start with front one first, please. Pitching outside off, impact in line, we get umpire's call. I'm going back to Shaikat on field. Shaikat, you're going to stay with your not out decision. Please stand by. You can signal now, you're on screen. Just by your feather. I scrammed him for space, but that is the way to go. I think these two are doing it well, getting the singles when you don't get the opportunities with freebies. Or... Now, whoops, in away. Innovation pays off for Lidon Kumar Streaks away to the boundary. Well, you've got to watch this though. Yeah, you're right. That was a picture there that you did see. But you can't miss this, can you? This is great. In position, flick of the wrists. Needed that boundary. They needed to throw a punch at the Sri Lankans. You don't want aggravate it anymore. Straight away, it's up in there, it's flooding, there's a fielder coming around and taking the catch. He got a little greedy, very first ball that Dalanja, the silver bowl, Litton tried to whip it away, got the leading edge and he's back in the hut now. Dalanja to Silva, wicked off the first ball, you can understand what Litton Das was trying to do. There was no one behind square, so he goes across, but we've seen this right throughout the game. There is extra bounce on offer. Batters have struggled to time it. He got a little dizzy, Sharnaka, but managed to hang on to it. They didn't expect that, but they've got that wicket. Litton Das has thrown it away again. 
We see that way too often. He's gone for seven. Two. Two. Oh, he's got the wicket straight away. Candice, what a fantastic delivery. Just kept a tad low. Shanto tried to get down on it. It was right through and really scattered his stumps. Well, you want to see what he can do? He can do that. He gets Bangladesh's best player, Bangladesh's captain. Low, slingy action. He gets the ball to move back in. The length so good. Caught on the crease and don't look surprised. It's a low bowling action. Low release point. It's not going to bounce as much. He's gone for one. Oh, he's got another one. This is unbelievable. The stumps go flying. It's a surprised look from Tawhid Ridai. But what a sight for a pace bowler when uh, the stumps go tumbling round. So good to watch. Nuan Tushara just keeps coming hard at the batter. But he has to walk. Head down goes Tawhid Ridai. Nice seam position. That is brilliant. Goes towards that onside and then swings towards the offside. He can be quick. He's sharp. He's deceptive, Nuan Tushara. And what a start to him in this game. Ridoy gone. First ball dark. Oh, almost got down. That's a quick one. And he's got it. That is the hat trick from Nuan Tushara. Incredible bowling here. Got Mahmudula. I think he's gone for the review. Tadam Patu Director, we have a player review for LBW. On field decision is out. Here comes the ball checker. Ball pitching in line. Impact umpire's call. We get umpire's call. I'm going back to Tanvir on field. Tanvir, you are going to stay with your out decision. Please stand by. You're on screen, you can signal now. Too good, they can't believe it. Sri Lanka celebrate, Nuan Tushara celebrates. Mamadou Lariad, first ball dark again. Fifth. Whips that away, that's going to go beyond the field. Uh, four runs to ease the batter, his nerves, and also give some sucker to the crowd here. We have been stunned. But the events of the last over. Too straight. Balls did swing and bounce when he went outside off stump. Looking for it, but doesn't get it. It goes on with the angle. Hit that with disdain. That's a terrific shot from uh, Shomo Shorka. It's a decent over for Bangladesh. Eight coming from it. Off to five. 23 for four. That rovers. Well, they again. So, Mr. Sarkar all ends up. Beat for pace, beat for swing, and Nuan Tushara is in form. Well, it's not a replay from the previous over that he bowled. This is a new over, and once again hits the length and the line. All he has to do is beat the bat, and it goes on through the defenses. That goes on to it. Hit Temba. What a delivery. And this time it's Shumushoka who has to head back. He's started that over. Shumushoka goes for 11. They need to go. Ah! Cl oh, close. Close. Given. And he's taking the review. Ball pitching in line, impact in line, wickets hitting. I'm going back to Saikat on field. Saikat, you are going to stay with your out decision. You are on screen. You can signal now. Another one bites the dust. They cannot believe it. Takarelli goes for four. Oh, huge joy towards mid wicket. Bindu Fernando at uh, deep square leg. I think he has saved the, a run for Sri Lanka. 
Look at that beautiful. Oh, what a guy is that taken? No, he's not sure. It flew low to his uh, Sadiras Samara Vikrama, was the fielder. Keep it rolling through. The next decision is not out, but nearly, nearly. Oh, he's hit, hit that. He's hit that clean. As we shot downtown for a flat six. 50s up for Bangladesh and hence the cheers. He tried to buy a wicket. Hasaranga suspended for the first two T20s. is here trying to get more wickets. That's what he does. He bowls it over that little hill. It goes above that. Richard goes again, this time different area, deep mid wicket in contention, no, over, over his head, result the same, back to back sixes from Richard. Good strike, that's brought the crowd alive, yeah, you've got to do something, you cannot die wandering. He hits it again, he connects it again. What a six to end the over. Rishad is taking them on. Well done with. It's 65 for six. So it comes down the wicket, charges the bowler, starts the over with the boundary, does check by the. You've got to love the Bangladeshi fan who always supports the team. Whatever the fortunes are, they're always behind them. I'm liking this partnership, 37 of 26, got to make an attempt, you have to and that's what they do. I mentioned before, it doesn't matter. Nice. Nicely placed, away from the fielder at short fine and it's a fine boundary. That's playing your options really well. He pitched it up, he went over cover. He expects the length to be slightly shorter, and it is. Helps it on its way. Well, if you look at the required rate, 13.3. And he gets the wicket right on cue. That's why he's a champion. Tossed it up ever so nicely, and uh, Mahdi Hassan, well, he couldn't resist the wrong end. How often do we see Hasaranga do this when you really need him to show up? Come with a peach of a delivery. Stump to stump. Slight deviations either way and he's so hard to pick. He tried too much to do, Mighty Hassan, 19 of 20. He does. It was an outside edge. I think it brushed the keeper's gloves on the way also in a series for a Sri Lankan batter. Oh dear, oh dear. <laughs> Nuan Tushara, he's done him. The spin. Well, you can forgive him today for that one. Thank you. Not much in comparison to the damage he has done to the opposition. Sweeps it, sweeps it well. One bounce for four from Taskin Ahmed. Oh, it's in the slot and it's uh, hit it many a mile. That's a big six from Rishad. It's hitting it sweetly. He's got a wonderful swing. That's his fourth sixer. Tossed it up. <laughs> and then watches it sail into the crowd. He goes again. Oh, yes. Wings deployed off the runway. Goes for another maximum. That's where it works for you. Stick with what works. Again, goes down on one knee. He was uh, properly underneath it. He goes again. Oh, yes. That's launched off the runway. And the crowd erupts in Cow Corner. That 
that's it. 100 on the board, three sixers in that over. 102 for seven after 15. 100 on the board. Now, uh, that's maybe perhaps just off uh, the hip. But doesn't really matter. It gets the card going. Oh, short ball pulled away. He's not uh, messing around with the bat. He brings up his first 50 in style with a massive uh, six into the hills. How often do you see a batsman scoring a half century without a single boundary and seven sixes? Bangladesh started losing wickets one after another. Now that's the 50, 79 meters. They picked up wickets of Camino Mendes and Angelo Matthews. Oh, close, close, given. The front on first, please. Well, pitching outside leg stum, and going back to Saikat on field. Saikat, you need to change your decision from out to not out. You are on screen, you can signal now. Oh, he's gone, he's gone up in the air. That's gone a long way. Fielder comes underneath it and takes it. Finally. Wicket keeper by choice, forced to feel, and takes it pretty easily. My six and pulling the length back, probably expecting a fuller delivery, Richard. Trying to go straight, couldn't get the timing right. Bat turning in his hands and Sadira Samara Vikrama. Oh, <laughs> to get rid of Richard Hussain for a magnificent 53. Oh, could have easily been another wicket here, but he's gone to the boundary. He's uh, been called to finish up things with uh, the first one has gone and gone over the ropes for a, a maximum. He really went after it, didn't he, Tashkin Ahmed? Uh, full the Christian Singh carried it, uh, Tashkin Ahmed. Thick outside, a slow ball to start with by Nuan Toshara. The end with third man in the circle, that's a wrong line to bowl. Asking for risk. And fortune favours the Braves. Straight after that, mid-off comes in. Oh, shot! What a shot that is! Incredible shot from uh, Tashkin Ahmed. Square on the offside and gone for the maximum. Two and two. I'll say it now. That's a shot of the series for me. Oh, extra cover. A tail ender against a bowler who has picked up four wickets. Nice high elbow and into the hills it goes. What a shot, Tuskin Armand. Oh, 82 meters. Almost to the TS states. 42 and 16. One handed. Might be in trouble. Taken. He picks up another one. And he gets a Pfeiffer. That is magnificent from uh, Numan Tashara. Come the, uh, come the man, Nuan Tushara getting his opportunity in this series. Curtis of an injury for Matej Patirana. Picks up four wickets with the new ball and finishes spell with his fifth wicket with Dasun Shanaka holding on. Take a bow, young man. Made the country proud in a very important game. Chariful gone for four, 134 for nine. Really brilliant. And they're still going, they're still going. Oh, yeah, it is Charit Asalanka who couldn't hold on to it. It was way up in the air for such a long time. It went to the orbit <laughs> and it took a star down with it. It went so far high and the problem was Charit Asalanka had so much time to settle down, he never looked comfortable. The base wasn't there, he's moving everywhere in the end. He's been taking some good. We need you up. Six. Would you believe it? It's the Fizz who picks up another six. Uh, they're dealing in sixes at the moment. Oh, what a catch! 
What a catch to finish the innings. It looked like it was going over on top of that field. Tananjaya De Silva timed it to perfection. Tan umpire to director, we have an umpire FL for fair catch. I've checked the fit. It's a fair delivery. We can go to the best angle of the catch, please. Catches the ball. Throws it up. Goes back. Comes back in. Rocket out. That was a magnificent effort and a Sri Lanka winning the series 2-1. Cheaply and very, very quickly, one after another. Sri Lanka's way. Sri Lanka winning by 28 runs. The Bangladesh in reply getting bowled out in 19.4 overs. Yeah, bowling card for Sri Lanka, led by that man, N. Tushara. Four overs, 16 dot deliveries, 20 runs and five wickets. He did the damage with the new ball with four wickets. In the end, 5 for 20. Match winning performance, 174 for 7. But uh, no one there apart from Mataski Nama to support him. Outstanding effort, brilliant. Collective effort, no one. Tushara was uh, the hero, the player of the match. Kusal Mendes, player of the series with 181 runs. Brilliant. Uh, excellent work. Excellent work from uh, Sri Lanka. For more updates, subscribe to our YouTube channel and click on the bell icon. Follow us on Facebook and Instagram. Download T-Sports app to enjoy exciting games and highlights. Visit tsports.com.